I'm just gonna speed this part up in like three times, that way it's nice and fast. But yeah. Hey, what is up, my Trey Squad? It is Kleine Wild here back today with another video. Welcome to or welcome back to my channel. All my socials are linked below and I definitely recommend following them. Anyway, so for a personal reason, I went away on a road trip and basically I got a few places to review with you guys. I hope you enjoy. Also, sorry for background noise and I hope you enjoy the new intro. There will be a new one after Thanksgiving for Christmas time and I will do Christmas videos after that. Anyway, so we're just going to begin because today we're going to review several places I bought. So yeah. I think I bought five or so, but the total with buying a Christmas pack was $10, so yeah, let's just get started. So the first place I bought was a fancy restaurant. These are all in US dollars, so yeah, so I'm showing you them being bought, and yeah. Also, I do apologize for the notifications, there's no way for me to edit them out and show you what each place looks like, you know, while it's being bought, so yeah. So, the next place I did buy was the airport because I want to do role plays in there. I only really recommend this place if you do do a lot of role plays because if you don't do that many role plays, the place is kind of pointless. And yeah, I do think that this place is pretty affordable though. And it did definitely add a place next to like the island area. So yeah. So then the third place I got was a movie studio, which is $2.99 in US dollars. And this place is so much fun. I literally love this place. There's so much I want to take into my house from this place. Um, so yeah, I definitely really like how much items there is. And yeah, I think this place is worth it. So then I got the vet. The vet has so much cute animals and I definitely will be doing a video basically getting a new pet. So yeah, I definitely recommend the vet. It is pretty inexpensive considering it's Toka World. And I definitely like love this place moving along because today's video is a little bit on the longer side i got the daycare i really do like the daycare just because you know it's cool to drop your kids off and in that aspect i think it's pretty cool and realistic and as you can tell this did add like a new location if you know what i mean to my map so that's really cool i plan on getting a few more of those places time coming up but yeah, but anyways, so I did buy one or two more packs, I believe. So the next pack is the Hot Springs, which I'm pretty sure is the last place I got besides the Christmas pack. But anyway, so the Hot Spring, I definitely recommend. It has definitely a lot of aesthetic bathroom items, and I just really like this place. So the first place we're going to go into is the first floor of the fancy restaurant. And I'm not going to go through every detail just because this video would be too long. But anyway, I do really like this place, and this paper does have a code. I think I'm going to open it, like, now. Yeah, so that does have a secret code. I do think that this place is really cute, and I will be spilling any secrets I do know. For example, this one, when you press down all the blocks, you get this crumpet. I haven't taken anything out of the place, BTW. And this dishwasher is cute. There's a cute little area of, like, hats. And some bakery chef stuff. Well, aprons. And yeah. Also, there's a bowl on the floor. I haven't quite figured out why. But it has food in it. Then you move over and here's the kitchen. I like this area a lot, actually. I just think that it's really cute. And I enjoy this place quite a bit. So, yeah. I definitely plan on stealing a lot of things from this place into my house and all these places, so let me know if you want me to do a video on like everything I do end up stealing because I really do like this place and I just think it's really fun. I've been looking for lasagna for so long, so I'm super glad to find it. So yeah. Anyway, I'm just going to do a fast like 3 second version of this just because I want to show you all the recipes. Anyway, here's the back room and I did show you this quite quickly. But there's also a penguin in there, which is super cute. And I do really like the marshmallows and the sauce and the plenty, like, lasagna. So, anyway, here's, like, a briefcase of a little secret. Nothing too fancy. Um, anyway, and let's go to floor two. So, right when you scroll all the way to floor two, all the way down on this side, it's a really cute area. I think they were trying to, like, propose or something. But anyway, then we have the carrot fizz. 
and over here here is the right code and you can take out the silverware and there's a gem in there personally i do not collect gems but if you do collect gems you can obviously go and seal it and yeah anyway then when you scroll past just a tad you have this cart with the breadsticks and then we have this dessert station which i think is so cute and honestly just really fun I do want to really use this place for role plays, so I'm super excited to do that. Um, yeah. So, yeah. So, this place is definitely really cute. And then when you move over, you have the dog, and there's, like, a golden poop underneath, and I think it's just really cute. Wow. I have said it is really cute a lot in this video so far. Anyway, so, then you have, like, this stool for the piano, and these napkins, and, like, this box of silverware. So then you continue scrolling and you do have this little station and you also have the breadsticks and you do have high chairs, which is really cute. So then in this bathroom, there's some nice towels, which I want to steal as well. But anyway, this place is super cute. And then when you move like past a little bit and then there's one more room and it's like a dressing room full of another high chair, plenty of clothes. So yeah. Also, there's these really cute passports, which is super cute, and I appreciate. Well, menus, not passports. Anyway, so let's check out the airport now. So here's the airport. So when you first enter, there's these cars and a bird, a ATM machine. It's a pretty basic airport. Anyway, then you move over and you have plane tickets and passports and this, like, dog thing. Then I showed you everything that's in the suitcases, if you're wondering. You can also change it, which is super cool. So then you scroll past a little and you have like this station when you can put things in and see it, like, you know, in the x-ray part. And then there's stuff in this like clear case, I guess, that got taken away from them. You can also put people in this thing, which is pretty cool. Anyway, so we're back. So when you scroll, you have a vending machine and you can press down and get a crumpet. I did throw it away to show you that it does come back. Anyway, so here is the plane. It's pretty basic. There's nothing in any of the cupboards. Anyway, then there's like a cute snack station. And over here we have a cute dog that's kind of like running the plane with this guy or girl. Anyway, so the next place is the movie studio. This part definitely took up a lot of today's video. Anyway, so here's like a cute camper with a gem. I feel like every time there's a vent, you should always check for a gem. Sorry for the background noise, my dogs are barking. But then there's the door, and then there's a crazy cat place. I don't know what this place really is, but I think it's really cute. Anyway, so then you move over and you have the snack station and the elevator. So now we're going to tour floor two. So, sorry about that flip, oh my lord. Anyway, so here's like a poster board, and then the makeup station, which is my favorite station in this place. I love how many different blushes and compartments and brushes and, you know, everything like that. I like this station a lot, like I said. I think that's really cool how there's all sorts of different things for everybody and all different skin tones. Anyway, so when you scroll over is the little bit of, like, the stage stuff, which in a second it will show you, but um, there's all sorts of different, like, effects One's for rain, I'll definitely be taking. One's for snowing, I'll also definitely be taking for Christmas videos. There's all sorts of different ones, so you guys can kind of tour that out. Um, yeah. If you have made it this far in the video, comment a teddy bear emoji. Anyway, so then you can also press the arrows. Like I said, I was making sure everything is turned off. And this one, you can take everything from here and put it in front of your house. The elevator... I'm super excited about it. Anyway, then you just have the stage stuff, this, like, island and home decor, which is super cool. I may steal a few things also from this place. And then there's, like, the dumpster and all that fun stuff. Anyway, so now let's go to floor three. Floor three is the last floor of this place, but anyway, there's this really cute dog wearing this shirt, this cool coffee cup, and we can feed the dog a little treat. Okay. Don't feed your dogs those treats in real life. Please don't. And guys, it gets so much cuter. Look, there's a little bowl for the dog. Anyway, so when you scroll down, there's like a movie set. There's like some roses, a button to press, um, which you can change like the effects for things and the sound. 
This computer is also really cute for like a YouTube role play or something. Anyway, so then you move over and there's like this entrance. A lot of people use that entrance for TikToks. Then there's a new stand, which is super cute and another door. So now we're gonna move on to the daycare. So comment down below if you want me to do a video specifically on one place. But then there's this cute little area for kids to sleep. You can pick this up, but I'm pretty sure you can put it in like a box or something. So to teach the kids responsibility, we also have this like little hamster exclosure. Then there's definitely some toys and blocks and stuff for this girl to use or any character in general. But I would rate the daycare like an 8 out of 10 because I think it's pretty small, but it's only 99 cents in the US, which is cheap for like the packs. Also, the clothes are really cute. Anyway, so then you have the station with toys and there's a gem hidden in the backpack. Well, not really hidden, but you know what I mean. And then you can hang up coats and stuff and then there's food. So then you scroll over and you have your little outside area. So I have messed with this area quite a bit, but anyway, you can plant stuff and use this cute like little watering can and you will have a flower, strawberry. We'll just feed him the strawberry. Um, so then you can like replant it and get another strawberry. Anyway, the play outside area is pretty small, but there is like a baby dress. So yeah, and then you have some characters and you can build this thing. You could probably find these places well, these, like, little things for the castle, probably everywhere. But you can also go into the mud, and, yeah. You can probably wash off using the watering can or something like that. So, yeah. There's also, like, this thing. It's kind of weird, but, um, anyway. So, the next place is the vet. And over here, when you scroll all the way, there's this cute, like, little dog in this room. There's a different movie on, um, then there's some clothes that you can take if you want them, obviously. Um, and then there's some CDs, and then you have a fridge and plenty of, like, plants and stuff up there. So then we have outside, we have this, like, little hat and some milk. Anyway, so when you scroll, you have this, like, poop bag area, and you can put the poop in the bags and close the bags and then throw them away. This is cute for little interactions. Anyway, I don't know why I spent so long doing this, so then in the next part, you have all these sorts of different pets, and they have all these cool pillows, um, and you have this, like, little thing, and I thought it was so cute how things were, like, ripped out. Then you have, like, a bug and some more pillows, and this dog is really cute, um, yeah. So, what I think is cool is, like, how detailed this place is. Anyway, so then you have a basic bathroom, you can take the plants and the money, Anyway, so then you move over, and this is my favorite area. There's some little eye drops, and then you have medicines of all sorts. So that's cool, and you have, like, this frog that's hiding. And so we gave the frog the medicine and the food, because why not? So then you have, like, these tickets or passes of some kind underneath, and, like, the pen so you can write stuff down, which is super cute, and, like, a matching credit card. Anyway, so then we have the little otter, and you can give him shots or whatever. I feel bad for the poor dude, though. The last place in today's video is the spa, or the hot spring, whatever you want to call it. So, this guy is kind of like the guy who's running it, or a girl, we don't know. So, then you have these robes that you can put, and then you have towels and this cool, like, face mask. The soaps are so cute, and so is the popcorn. I really like this detail. I don't know why, but I see these in a bunch of house builds. They're really aesthetic, and I really like these products. Anyway, then you have, like, candy and this, like, lamp, I guess. And then you have four lockers. One has bathing suits, which is the one that I'm messing with right now. And then the one next to it has this air horn. This one just has these two outfits. And then the last one has, like, spa stuff, if that makes sense. Then you have, like, popcorn and drinks, which is kind of cute. So, now we're gonna move on. There's also this, like, weird guy. If I don't know if you'd want him or not, but you could also use him in roleplay. Anyway, so then you move over slightly, and you have this little area where there's a towel and a bucket of water. You can add, like, water into the bucket, which is cute. And then behind him, there's a bunch of drinks, and you can take off the cucumber patches on him. And you could also take off the face mask or put it on him. 
Anyway, so then there's some candles. I didn't test if you could take them off or not, so I honestly don't know. But yeah, so then you move over and there's like these snowballs you can stack. This guy has a tree on his head, so that's kind of cute. Anyway, so then you move over and there's this really cute polar bear, this cute goat. We can feed the goat. And then you can pull out flowers and there's these two people hiking. If that's what they're doing, I'm not too sure. Then there's like a cooler and this hot chocolate thermos is so cute. And you have two pandas here, I don't know why. And then you have some chicks with their eggs and all sorts of different animals. So that brings me to the end of today's video. So shout out goes to this girl. Her user is on TikTok, so go follow it. Anyway, I also have a collab with her BTW. So that's the end of today's video. I hope you enjoyed. I know this video took quite a bit of time, but I didn't know what to do. And then I decided what to do and it took a while to edit. But anyway, I hope you enjoy my new intro and I changed up my bio and everything a little bit. Um, so yeah, so that's the end of today's video and I hope you enjoy. Bye!